What's going on, family? As we promised, new video, same day. But uh, didn't want to beat you guys up with the same video, man. But listen, about to go take a ride in the Mozzie. I'm excited. All right, guys, listen, it's about to go down. It's happening for real. It needs to be said, as much as I love this car and there are some shortcomings, probably the biggest shortcoming of the car is the key. <laughs> this is the worst key oh, for $140,000. Is... Oh, my God. But here's Brother, the thing. Nissan key. <laughs> <laughs> this is i put this someone's like oh it's like a volkswagen key i'm like it's worse it's oh, way worse wow. this one has also been through the ringer it's not very nice to need to get another one made Ugh. but i do appreciate a manual key nowadays everything everything in this car as far as the operations there is mechanical and electronic door actuators yeah this is Really shitty for a hundred forty thousand. I just thought it was a funny talking. Oh there you go, my sir. god! Imagine getting a brand new Maserati to do it. Like you congratulations, this. sir, and they slap that key. key in your hand. Yeah. <laughs> Let's check it out, guys. Let's check it out. Oh my goodness! I just got to keep it realistic because it's funnier that way. <laughs> All right. God, this thing feels so solid. Yeah, and that's the most surprising thing, I think, when most people get in the car is they're like, it actually doesn't feel like a pile of junk. Oh, this thing sounds so good. My head is hitting the <laughs> handle. I gotta <laughs> drop my seat. Whew. All right. Oh, man. Is the audio going to pick up? It'll, it'll be the exhaust? I don't think uh, so, man. I think we could pull that off, then. Because we're in a car. Okay, so, I here, think we could pull so the here's how off. we do the exhaust, then. We got to do the windows almost all the way. So, like, right about there. Okay. It's The switch is annoying. You'll see. Yeah. Okay, that's good. And leave the rear ones down. Okay. Because then you'll get all the exhaust. Okay. So, we could pull the mic off. Okay. So, we can... There we go. We can all enjoy right. real sound. <sighs> All right, so as I said, so we're already in sport mode. That is the way to drive this car is in sport mode. Okay. And shift the, the shifter over to the left. Now you're in manual and it will uh, not shift up without your input wow. ever. All right. You can slap the limiter in first and it will not upshift. Oh my God. So. Okay, guys, let's go. Let's get it. It also needs to be said, there's almost no videos on the internet about this car. So, oh, <laughs> this thing sounds absolutely amazing. Can mm -hmm. we get out there? Yeah, we can. And we're also just cruising around. <laughs> and my favorite thing has to be the. Uh, by the way, it will downshift for you if the if the revs get too low. Yeah. Um, my favorite thing about this car has to be the reactivity of the steering. It does feel very, very nice. This Especially thing at feels speed. Uh, amazing. Which way you want to go? Uh, probably go right. Right and then right? Yeah, probably. <laughs> Sounds so good. <laughs> Gotta get used to that a little bit. Let's get out of it. Okay, well, uh, 
It does open up a little bit. I think you'll be able to do a U-turn at some point. Yeah, we'll bust around probably. See how far this, this truck is probably gonna go all the way down. I'm gonna let him go out a little bit. Yeah. Give him a little space. And then we'll get on it a little bit and turn around. This thing is so nice, bro. I see, I'm feeling this ride. <laughs> It feels so sporty. It does not feel like just that soggy sedan. It does not feel soggy at all. It's not like a couch no, at all. No, man. This, no, man. I've driven some really impressive sedans that do a lot of things, but one of the things that this car is all the time is, is occasion. God. It feels like an occasion every time you drive it. That's what I love about the vet. You know, I get giddy. I get excited when I'm about to get out and go jump in the car. Yeah. Leaving out of my community is just always a little treat, mm -hmm. you know, until I can get on the highway and I'm going on it. Like you said, it's always an event. This yeah. thing. Ooh, look at that. This thing. And it pulls. Man, it pulls. Yeah. It's a little dead on torque around 2500, but it's no chore to downshift this thing because it's And I just love how it's a torque converter and it acts like it isn't. Oh, this is this is this is really really good. <laughs> Ooh, and it, so this thing shifts really quick too. Yeah. I, it, very impressive. My car don't shift this fast. It's insane for an 09, right? This thing shifts fast. It's it's <laughs> way faster than my car. I just love the reactivity, like when you're not on the gas, it will slow down your shift. Yeah, it's like yeah. kind of like, okay, you want to relax a little yeah. bit. So it will shift even harder if you're flat. Like oh it's, my God. it is really impressive. The former F1 driver, Ivan Capelli, actually tuned this gearbox with Maserati. So that's some good street cred. This thing is, is really, really awesome, man. We're going to bust you so we can. This thing is super, super nice, man. Yeah, I see why you waited. Yeah. I, I absolutely agree with you. I support it. And, well, I, I did, regardless, before even getting into this thing, yeah. supported you waiting or making a move when you did because mm -hmm. it's not that often you get a chance to get what you want. Right. And you could probably U-turn up here. I'm up to go right where this truck to Yeah, I'm going to turn right and U-turn. Yep. It's fine with me. Oof. <laughs> Oof. Go around here real quick. The cops think we're doing nothing. No shenanigans around here. Oh, there's shenanigans. <laughs> That's not a cop, that's a that's a Honda. Oh, is it? Yeah. <laughs> I was like, what do you mean the cops? I thought that was the cop over. Come on, man. <laughs> hey man, it's the light. That's fair. They used to have a cop right there every once in a while, so. This right. thing is just too cool, man. Go ahead and ring it out. Yes. Like on like just a touch. And oh my god! Yeah, 
Yes, sir. Yes, sir. I truly <laughs> and utterly approve. <laughs> yeah. How many gears is transmission on this? Six. Six gears. Oh man. The best part about it is Maserati didn't make it. <sighs> CF. <sighs> best in the business, basically. Jeez. Everything fast nowadays has a ZF. Yeah, so, that's true. You're yeah, absolutely right. Or a 10 speed from Ford GM. Right, but, uh, right. Yeah. Oh my God. Yep. Very good. Does it live up to the hype? Yes. For yes. me, looks and talking about it is one thing, but the Are one thing is just to drive it because it is one of those cars that is like no matter what people will say or no matter what I say, <laughs> until you get one in your hands behind the wheel, you won't really get it. <laughs> this thing feels good, bro. Yeah. Oh my god. <laughs> so this is the boss car, man. I'm wheeling the boss car. It, and it feels nice. So that transmission is super snappy. The car sounds amazing. Being able to bounce off the rev limiter is like, like, God, I feel like I'm fast and fierce around here. It's just, <laughs> it's just really, really cool, right? Um, the car rides, it feels super, super sporty. It makes you feel like it's ready to do something. I feel like it's ready to go all the time, man. Do yourself a favor, downshift one more time, and just coast around 3,500 RPM. Just put your foot down a little. And the howl. Oh yeah. The, just before thousand. Just before four thousand. It's yeah. just like. Yeah, it's very good. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Man, listen to the downshifts. <laughs> that howl. Okay. Yeah. That howl is something else. All right. You, you know can, what? You can drive it around the block to feel what it's like on like a normal basis and to your point that howl yep that is excellent sound yeah, that howl think. right there at that rpm i think there's we, very few we have to do a drive-by beautiful maserati exhaust this just sounds so good that it, i like the way you describe it the howl yeah it's right. it's a howl I think there's very few engines that can really classify as musical in instruments, but this is probably one of them. Yeah, I would agree. Because the, the range of sounds at different RPMs are so different. It really is. I just is, love the way it sounds, man. really is, to me, the all-time greatest oh, cross-plane V8. Ugh, it's gorgeous. Ugh. <laughs> Like a little kid over here. <laughs> you know, I'm going straight to paddles when I get in my car. <laughs> oh, <yeah. laughs> oh, man. No, this. No, no, no. We got to go back down. You cannot be on the brake when you go back down no, to one. No, you can't because the engine brakes so hard. You have to kind of lift your foot. That's exactly why I kept bucking him when I went back down. This yeah. thing. <sighs> so. Very good. Good? Very, very good. <laughs> God, I'm go. super impressed. This is. Yeah, brother. <laughs> You did a great job. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, bro. Thank you. Oh, my God. Yeah, when the, the light goes down, the dash lights up green on the numbers, and uh, same with the clock, and it's it's a cool experience at night. Driving this car at night is my favorite thing because the vibe is just crazy. This is like a perfect night crawler car. Like, this is like, you want a bar crawl, too? Like, you're going to... This car, by the way, needs to be said... If you're into cars, but you kind of like a little bit of uh, street cred on like the cars, uh, car uh, shows, See, yeah. this is not for you. 
because you will get no play. You go People to a don't show, know what it is. No one really has an idea what it is. And um, I kind of accepted that when I was buying the car. I'm just like, whatever. Everyone's going to think I'm a douche. That's why I got a Sigma plate. Because it's like <laughs> the douchiest thing you can do. So, um, but but downtown or in any kind of city center, if you're letting the, end, like the exhaust howl, you don't even have to be like a douche. <sighs> This thing is a neck snapper. It gets all kinds of play from Sounds people who amazing. don't know anything about cars because I guess some people still have like a really strong public opinion about Maserati, but like car guys are like, oh, they're just overpriced junk. And, and I think those are, that complaint or that statement's kind of valid a lot of the time, especially with like newer stuff. Yeah. But this is that exception to the yeah, rule. Yeah, this is, this is a very, very special car. She's super, super nice. There's just so much here. It's super, super, super nice. So you need some exhaust sounds from the outside? Ah, uh, yeah. Let's let's get it. All right. This thing is super, super cool. Oh. Thank you, sir. Just call it right there, bro. We don't do normal around here, bro. That's not normal, man. Nah, we don't do normal around here. Why is that? Uh, I don't remember the line. <laughs> designed from greatness, brother. Yes, yes, yes. <laughs> this car was designed from greatness. Come on, let's think about that. Hang on. It was designed with pure idiocy, <laughs> and it turned into greatness. There you this. go. There you go. Some things are not great. Until they become great. There you go, bro. Because of that, man, listen, man. You guys have the right, the authority, the responsibility to never, ever, ever be average. So, guys, don't be average. Yeah.